series, excuse me, is Bailey Hockman. So the quarterback that is now at Middle Tennessee State just transferred there, but he was the he started the majority of the games for NC State this past season. Uh, and then uh, a few years prior was at, actually at Florida State. So he went from Florida State, NC State, now he's at Middle Tennessee State. But I think that's a great fit for Bailey Hockman. And he got some valuable experience as he was the starter for the majority of games for, for the Wolfpack. Did some really nice things. Was very accurate with the with the football. Almost at 65. Uh, all, his completion percentage was almost at 65, which is which is which is a great number, especially uh, kind of starting his his first real season this past season for for the Wolfpack. So I think he's got a good future at Middle Tennessee State. Uh, Middle Tennessee is having some turnover. They, they had a stud quarterback last year, Asher O'Hara, who is now transferred and he's going to Sacramento State. Their OC is no longer there, so they have a new OC. It was Kansas's OC the past few years. He did some good things at Kansas, and before that was at a smaller school, NAIA school, I believe Bethel uh, was the school. I can't remember if it's Bethel College or Bethel University, but uh, he, his offense was explosive there. So he's got a good track record, track record. So I think combining Hawkman with their new OC at Middle Tennessee State is, is going to be a good thing for Middle Tennessee, who needs some help offensively and needs some help pushing the ball downfield. That's something Hawkman can do. Hawkman's got a strong arm, but he's athletic enough to move around the pocket. That's going to kind of remind you of a, a Brent Stockstill, the quarterback with Floral O'Hara. He's not going to, uh, you know, make a bunch of defenders miss like O'Hara did. O'Hara's awesome uh, running the ball, but you might he he, he might remind some Middle C State fans of Brent Stockstill because he's athletic quarterback, but he's looking to throw and he's a lefty. So let's go ahead and look at one of the clips uh, that that Bailey Hawkman has from this past season while he was at NC State. So this clip is definitely going to remind Middle C State fans of Brent Stockstill. Just watch this. Slips, runs in the pocket, eyes downfield. Let's watch it one more time. Let's see here. So you see pressure gets to him. His eyes stay downfield the whole time. He's able to go off script, throw a good ball. Boom. So if you're a Middle Tennessee State fan, there's a lot to like about Bailey Hawkman and the new OC <clears throat> that they have coming in. Excuse me. I think their offense is going to be fun to watch, and uh, I think you'll probably see them back at the level they were at when Brent Stockstill was at quarterback. Uh, be very competitive in, the, in CUSA, uh, as they have in the past few years, but they uh, you know, could potentially take another step uh, with, with the new change and everything. But interesting to see regardless. Uh, but that's our 